Hi, I'm Herb Stevens, a skiing weatherman for the West Virginia Ski Areas Association with your exclusive weather forecast for wild and wonderful West Virginia. While you've been making your plans for skiing and riding over the MLK weekend the past few days, the mountain crews at West Virginia's resorts have been busy rehabbing the slopes in the wake of the early week thaw. Through a combination of snowmaking and grooming, surfaces that firmed up when the cold air returned have gradually been softening up. Trails that were closed for a short while are reopening, and I think you're going to be quite pleased with the conditions you'll find this weekend. Now, temperatures will be a little milder on Saturday, which means you won't have to ski or ride through plumes of machine-made snow, but those temperatures will be cold enough for continued snowmaking during the nighttime hours. On Sunday, an Arctic cold front will move through the state, and it will likely trigger a round of snow showers and squalls as it does, and that should help to soften the surfaces as well. MLK Day will be a cold, crisp midwinter's day, and the cold air will enable the snowmakers to continue their assault through next week. That's how it looks for skiing and snowboarding in wild and wonderful West Virginia. I'm Herb Stevens for the West Virginia Ski Areas Association. For the latest information from the resorts, go to GoSkiWV.com.